We need some motivation. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> That's motivation enough to get this thing over with. <laughs> Hello everybody, hi, hello, hello, and uh, welcome to the Feathers and Florence vlog number eight. Eight. Welcome. We hopefully, we hope, we hopefully, we hope you've had a really good weekend. We've had a very busy weekend uh, meeting lots of brides um, across, uh, across Lancashire, across all the regions. <laughs> <laughs> So we have enjoyed it. You've enjoyed it, right? Yeah. Good. Yeah. Well, no, You've just been sat at home. I've just been sat at home, yeah. Cleaning. Cle yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's my job. So if you are wondering what happens during a bridal appointment... Liam is not there, don't worry. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not anywhere in the vicinity. I'm at home cleaning the kitchen. That's pretty much... Oh, I'm running. Mm -hmm. And you're running around here. Um, so yeah, we do hope you had a great weekend. And uh, welcome to our vlog. If you haven't seen this vlog before, why not? First of all, why not? Um, and second of all, we, 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 we started doing these to give you a bit of an insight as to what happens behind the scenes here at the Feathers and Florence studio. Why else do we do these vlogs? Vanity. <laughs> Vanity. So we can see ourselves on a bigger screen. Is that no, so? no, it's not vanity. No, we just do it. To, to, and and to, to maybe a bit more education as well about mm -hmm. about you may be um, looking to buy your dream uh, wedding dress and you may not want to come and see us about it, but you may have questions and we hopefully can answer them questions as well and tell you a little bit more about us. Yeah, because it's, um, it's personal experience. You want to know who you're coming to visit. Yeah. Not Liam, don't panic. No, but, but you will, we will speak on the phone. Yeah, but um, just knowing that who you're visiting, that you like us. Now we've got some really exciting news for us and hopefully for quite a few other people as well, maybe uh, brides that may be coming to visit us, in that we have some additions to our curation, haven't we? And we're really excited about them. We got them last week and um, we just love them, don't we? We love them. Uh, so shall we tell them about it? Yeah. People watching. Yeah. Now, how do you want to do this? Like, I'm thinking like a supermarket sweep kind okay, of thing. Okay, talk to me. So, um, I'm just going to run around and show you okay. some new things that we've got. So, if I call something out, you could grab it and then and then talk to them about it. Is that how we should we do it? Right, okay. If you'd like to. Yeah, yeah. let's do it that way. But there's, you need to think about what you're calling out though, because Liam doesn't understand what bridal accessories are called. No, this is true. And he calls things the wrong name all the time. And I fear that you might shout something that we don't have. <laughs> <laughs> Wamsy. <laughs> oh, I'll go and get it. Wamsy. Go, <laughs> go and get some hot pants. Right, I'm going to go with it. So the first thing, uh, addition that I love to our curation, absolutely love, is our overskirts. So please let's show everybody a sample of our overskirt. Okay. Go for it. I'm going to hold your microphone. What's the theme tune for Supermarket Sweep? Super, supermarket Sweep? No, I don't know. Shall I just sing something or just leave it? Sing something in this, because it's going to be awkward when I'm moving around. Okay. Supermarket Sweep. Melissa's on the Supermarket Sweep. Are you, are you supposed to be dancing like that? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, is, oh, is that you doing a funny... Oh, okay. Yeah. So... <laughs> I, I, was, um, I was running around. Right. So tell us about it. Um, so this is one of a skirt that we've got in the studio. And it's absolutely beautiful. Yeah, it is beautiful. Um, so it's a... Can we clip it on? Yes, please. Um, so we've got this beautiful, it's a peony over skirt, beautiful floral lace on it, it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, and basically what we've added to the, oh no. It's always my phone going off. Again. Turn it off, man. <laughs> right, anyway, so, Tinder. <laughs> <laughs> it is Tinder. No, <laughs> um, 
So what we've added to the curation are ex bridal accessories so that you can create a, a, a very unique look to how to basically, a, a, you can create any bridal style that yeah. you imagine yeah. to suit your style. So whether that's you want a sleek uh, style for the evening, but you during the day you want more of a bigger skirt um, or even if you're thinking, oh, I like the top half of this dress, but I, I need more on the bottom, I, I feel conscious of maybe a tummy area yeah. or you don't love your bum, skirts are a great idea. Um, so all of the pieces that we've added are to give you options mm -hmm. so that you can almost have a base dress and add to it to create a really unique look to you. Love it, I um, love it. So yeah, we've, we've just added lots of pieces um, and you'll probably not, if you went for this kind of like not a mix and match style but if you went for this kind of like look it's very unlikely that you'll see another bride yeah in a similar look locally because you picked it and you Absolutely picked right. it to your preferences could you hold, hold it up a little bit more to camera? i think that'll go with you that microphone oh yeah, it yeah will, it will. so it. yeah yeah, just show a bit of the detail on it. Yes, so beautiful it is. Um, so yeah, we've just got absolutely gorgeous floral pattern. Um, and it, it's just a stunning addition. If you're thinking, I want quite a simple um, look on the top, but I just want a bit more of a skirt, then it's the perfect addition. Love that. So that's our first thing. Okay. You, if you are in love with this I skirt. I am in love with that skirt. I know. I, I, honestly, if, if I suited it and, and, you know, I would wear it. Oh. I know. No. So next on Melissa's supermarket sweep is our, one of our ball trains. A ball train? Ball train. Go for it. Okay. So. You have to. Come back. I will. Cut the arm. I've lost all energy now. <laughs> I did one run, nearly fell, and I've not gotten any energy. Yeah, beautiful. So another thing we've got, bows are really cool at the moment, so everybody's loving a bow. Um, and this is a bow train, so you can add this to any dress, uh, just to give you that bow at the back, and it's got a beautiful train as well. Um, so it just gives you that extra drama to the back of your dress. I love um, that word, extra drama. Yeah. That's really good. Yeah. I've heard that before. Extra drama? Yeah. God, I bring the extra drama every you do. day. You are the drama. <laughs> um, so, yeah, balls are really cool. And it just comes with a, a belt that you can clip around your waist. Um, so you could have it for your ceremony and you can take it off in the evening for an easier, kind of sleek, simple look. So it's just adding a little bit more kind of personality to yeah, your yeah. to your bridal style i know not everybody loves bows but if you don't what is going on in your mind because <laughs> we love bows we love a bow we love bows. most of our brides come in and, and when they've got a bow on some of them are like i don't want a bow i don't like bows they're too girly and then they've got a bow and they're like that's really nice detail <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> so yeah bow train love it it's just a little bit a personality and like i say it's um you can just whip it off in the evening so you've got like your nice sleek mm. simple dress and this can go over anything and um, if even if you've got quite a large train it looks yeah, incredible it does look incredible right microphone off next on melissa's supermarket suite let's show an example of our shrugs shrugs um because we've as i say uh, if you're just catching up with us We've got some new additions to our creation, which we are loving at the minute. Talk to us about shrugs. So, let's clip that back on. So, shrugs sound like awful, don't they? Like It's not the most pretty word I've ever heard. No, let's call it a... It's just a it's shimmy sleeve. A shimmy sleeve. So, shimmy sleeves. Go for it. <laughs> the detail is fantastic. Um, so, we've got this here. Um, it's got really beautiful sleeves with lace detail on the bottom uh, to give you this like puffy sleeve effect, which is really, really popular. Um, and this, again, can go over kind of like a really sleek, simple dress, but it gives you more than one look. Mm. So, you, if, one of our most popular dresses is our slip dress, yeah, Hazel. Yeah, of course, yeah. 
um, and it's really sexy. It's got a gorgeous back. Everybody loves the back because it's a V back with buttons down um, and a V front and it's a like a spaghetti strap. Mm. But then sometimes it can feel a little bit bare and people are a little bit worried to get married and yeah. go to their ceremony so exposed on their shoulders. So this is something that you can add um, just to give you a... I know it's kind of still... Uh, it's still see-through, but yeah. it just gives you a bit more comfort that you're yeah, covered. I like that. Um, and also just a little bit of detail as well. So that looks really cool. So, for example, I will show you the dress I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah, go for it. Go for it. Uh, you're on the move. So here we come. So this is a gorgeous dress. And like I say, this over top, just to give you a little bit of... Um, little bit of detail and coverage um, for your ceremony. It's or a great the oh, evening. It's a great combo, isn't it? Oh, I forgot. I it's went right. and put it on the mic on. No, no, no. Everyone can hear you. Don't worry. I don't hope you. so. Oh, hang on. Clipping my hair in it. Sorry. There we go. We haven't got this down to a smooth. No, 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 no. Not this morning. Um, is it? So this is the one that's really popular because it's got um, a feedback with beautiful buttons down. Um, and even if you're getting married, kind of like in the this is a great destination dress mm. but not everybody even if you're not getting married in a hot country and you're getting married in the uk which is not hot um, then this is still a stunning dress but if you're worried about as well being a little bit cool not that this is like a coat but it just takes a chill off a little bit in the like in it. the winter so like adding this is just you know, epic, isn't yeah. Because really? like I mean, you, do, I, I you've just got a dress that nobody else has. Because how many people are gonna say, "Oh, I want that dress and that"? What did we say? Combination. Shimmy sleeves. Shimmy sleeve combination. Yeah. Shimmy sleeve com <laughs> combination. You're gonna. It's gonna be very rare that two brides go for the same look. Love it. Right, so there are some of our additions to our curation that are just in in the last week or so, and so far. They have gone down really well, haven't they, Melissa? They've gone down really well with our with our brides. So um, what we would say is, uh, oh, are you talking? Oh, to I'm two talking mics? to two mics. Yeah. I thought that goes down well. Um, yeah, my voice over two mics is not what anybody wants. <laughs> um, so brilliantly well done on Supermarket Suite. Maybe next week I'm just going to pick a random, random dress or random design, and you're going to have to do do a show and tell. Yeah. Well done. Thank you. Well done. So, um, one of the things that- I'm gonna, sorry, just please, back to please, the supermarket screen. Next week, I'm gonna come back with a big blow up something. Well, yeah, like, like a pineapple or yeah, something. Yeah, big blow up pineapple. <laughs> In your basket. <laughs> um, uh, oh, yeah, some tins. Yeah. Uh, it's not still on, is it, Supermarket Suite? Yeah, they redid is it. it and um, Ryland, or oh, Ryland. Ry is it Ryland, Ryland? Clark, no? Yeah, but is it, does it have a D on the end, is what I'm saying? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. The one with Michael the Michael Barrymore teeth. for me. I was the Michael Barrymore generation. Well, it, but, but what I'm saying is Ryland brought it back. Oh, right, okay. Um, awesome. But people were annoying me on it. Were they? It used to be a really good game. I used to think I could be really good at it. But some people just like, dithering it's like, like they're going around where trolls booze 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 are the worst it's like <laughs> stop calling it booze you need to call it supermarket for ditherers <laughs> if you shop at booze Sorry. then let us know <laughs> um okay so we've got a few minutes left and i'd really like to ask you and i'm not sure what we're going to call this section it's going to be something a bit i'm going to come up with a name for it or we okay. might come up with a name but it's Effectively, Melissa's top trends for 2023-24. What have you been seeing that you think is going to be a really good, lovely trend for the next 12 months? Just pick one thing. In bridal or yeah. weddings as a whole? Um, well? Weddings and bridal. Okay. So, yeah, um, yeah. What do you think? Let's put me on the spot. I'll tell you what's making a comeback. Go on, tell me. Um... Not that they were ever out, but oh. like purple tones. Okay. Like deep purples, yeah, yeah, yeah. even like lilacs are making their way back. 
Purples. And flowers, you say, not table decorations. Table decorations, stationery. Wow. Like lilacs and purples are a really romantic, like yeah. relaxing colour mm. anyway. But I'm seeing a lot of people going for purples okay. again. Yeah, you're loving it. That, there's no reason. It's just a, a cyclical thing. It's just popular at the moment. I don't know. I'm not picking at the bright side. Oh yeah, true. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. If you've got if you've got some um, some purple at your wedding, we would like to know. We'd like mm. to see pictures. If you, after you got married, obviously, and we'd like to know why. But it is popular. Mm. That's really good. So ne the next couple of weeks, I might ask you again. What's hot at the minute? Okay. All right. Okay. So uh, we're about the time. Look at that. We hope you've enjoyed this vlog. I need to stop shifting in my chair. I know, it's really But I do that, it, it, it's like a, a news presenter, you know. Thank I you very know. much for watching. Yeah, you look, It's yeah. professional law, you do. Uh, but you can't just be professional in the way that you sit. You've got to do it as a whole. <laughs> and you just seem to have missed the professionalism elsewhere. Just done, shuffle my papers. <clears throat> Good night. <laughs> oh yeah, professionalism. Tinder were going off. Oh, it was. Way it was our front doorbell at home. <laughs> it was. So, <laughs> Amazon. Um, <laughs> so we hope that people have enjoyed it again, don't we? And mm -hmm. um, we're going to be back next week for vlog nine. Thank you very much for watching. Anything to add before we finish? No. Thank you. Uh, have a wonderful week, everybody. Um, uh, what? Oh, that's the oh. last thing to do. What should people do if they like this content? Ring the bell. Ring the bell. Like. Like. Ding. Comments. Yep. Share. Subscribe. Subscribe. Sub it's ringing the bell, not subscribe. No, we'll go over this separately. I'm getting really confused. We'll go over it separately. Ring the bell. Subscribe. Like. Comment. Share. Tell your neighbours. Tell your neighbours. And put get on. Have a wonderful week, everybody. See you uh, in about a week's time. Bye. Oh,